project helped us realize our school's vision, which has always believed that we should create informed citizens of the society who collaborate, create and work to improve quality of life. Through this project, they collaborated so beautifully. They moved their focus from being consumerists to creators of not only knowledge, but of material, lovely things. And we're confident that they're going to be absolutely very well informed global citizens that we have always envisioned. And this project has been an amazing experience. And I'm sure it's not only going to benefit our students at their personal level, but also in the community at large they live in. To fulfill the vision of the school, young entrepreneurs took up the challenge and started with full enthusiasm. Being a democratic setup, we brainstormed as every opinion mattered. Some brilliant ideas like jewelry making, handicraft, paper recycling, cafeteria, bangle making were shortlisted from many. At KIIT, every decision is made taking into account the opinions of students parents and teachers. All of them unanimously agreed to the idea of Nutri Cafe. Being a health promoting school, inculcating healthy eating habits in our learners was always a big challenge for us. We did not have a canteen in the school and most of our parents are working. So giving students a healthy meal in the lunch was really difficult. Then we decided why not do something about it in the school. So we converted a need into a great business opportunity and started a Nutri Cafe. I'm very happy with the decision that school is opening Nutri Cafe. Being a working woman, many times I'm not able to give a uh, tiffin to my child. Now I'm happy that my child will be having a nutritious food instead of having junk food. I'm quite happy with the school's decision and my consent is with the school uh, that uh, being a working woman that my child will get a nutritious food in the school itself. So as a parent I feel very happy that school is taking care of the health of the child which is very important and it is linked with, every, with, with the education also. While setting up any business, the biggest challenge is to create awareness and attract customers. Our school enterprise challenge team used assembly as a platform, put up banners at different places in school, conducted talks by dietitians, wore fancy dress costumes to arouse interest and word of mouth publicity. The first and the foremost challenge we faced is common for all business and you know that it's finance. So we decided to issue coupons to students in advance which they could redeem at the cafeteria which help us in arranging finance for the venture. It was a project for the students by the students. Their day began with preparations for the cooking. Making dishes as per the day's menu was the real teamwork. Organization and time management played the key role in selling the prepared food. Maintaining daybook helped us summarizing financial record in the end. Happy satisfied customers brought us unmatched joy. In the beginning, I was having a doubt that the food provided by the Nutri Cafe would not be as such good or it would be like other normal canteens. But when I later tried it out with my friends, the food was really good and nutritious and very tasty. As a customer, I am really satisfied. Apart from providing goods with optimum nutritional value and good quality, the main challenge in front of us was the variety in menu. In the beginning, after every 3-4 days, the sale used to get low because the students got bored of the same menu. Thus, to cope up with this challenge, we started rotating our menu every now and then. 
Soon, our Nutri Cafe and its mini competitions became so popular that everyone wanted to be a part of them. Whether it was Global Entrepreneurship Week or our International Club Festival, our sale records wrote our success story. Have a second look at our crowd if you still have doubts. We were successful in completing the tasks assigned to us by achieving the desired results. We took Nutri Cafe to a new direction. I learned how to check the feasibility of a project and check whether it is viable or not. Thank you. Even stock management is very responsible task. Maintaining the stock, entering the records in the cash book, matching the regular sales according to the list maintain, and sometimes there is a little bit difference between the stock maintain and the list. Customer is a king and a king has a dynamic behavior in terms of preference and taste. They would buy a product only when they wish to. According to that, we have to fulfill their requirements in a specific time. By working in Nutri Cafe, I learned the two important aspects of one's life, that is teamwork and coordination. By working in teams, we managed to achieve desired result effectively and efficiently. It also helped me to build up better understanding in me. So no doubt it was a great experience for me. It was a great learning experience for me. It helped me in enhancing my managerial skills like how to deal with customer. It taught me how to take right decision immediately in a tough situation when my decision can affect our potential customers. Participation in School Enterprise Challenge brought a dynamic shift in learning approach. Now our students are equipped with practical knowledge, practical experience. By participating in School Enterprise Challenge, we will able to produce more number of dynamic leaders and future managers. Before the launch of this project, our students were learning everything in theory. But after the, this project, they are able to develop each and everything with their real life situations and they are able to deliver everything in practical knowledge. They are able to relate each theoretical concept with their practical approach of learning. Now, we are able to produce more number of job providers instead of job seekers. Success comes after experience and experience comes after a bunch of good and bad experiences. Overall, I would say it was a healthy experience for our school children to gain the skill of entrepreneurship which is most required in the present world. KIIT always believes in working hand in hand with society and giving it back to them by helping in whatever way we can. We shared our profits with community being responsible and thinking global citizens. We donated blankets for Uttarakhand tragedy victims, visited slums with care and share team of our school to distribute food packs. Our parents were happy as now their children were getting wholesome meal in school. What brought the ultimate satisfaction to our school enterprise challenge team members was the happy expressions on the faces of poor children for whom we prepared community lunch.